Let's go in the water, Bob says. Maybe later, says he. Because I work uh, full time, I can't, um, I can't teach her like, like I would want to, you know? So I think her being in school and getting all that um, learning also, and early on, I think it's, it's gonna be better for her um, on the future. I really miss the kids, the interaction, the physical interaction with the kids, and that's why I was really very happy when um, we started the in-person learning. We do not know what to expect, but the district had set protocols in place and we feel that we can implement those protocols and make our kids safe. We talk about why is it important to wear masks. At first, we were having a hard time having them wear the mask all day. Now, I think it became part of their morning routine. Pete wants to surf all day. Bob does too, so they take turns. Her first language was Spanish, and then we introduced English, but I think being bilingual at a young age is it's great, especially because it's gonna help them in the future. Being bilingual, it's a really great thing. When we get them at the beginning of the school year, as compared to the end of the school year, we can see that there's so much progress in language. We really develop their social skills, their interaction with other, with peers as well as adults. And you can see not only the skills in math, reading, or social studies, but we also develop 21st century skills, which is creativity, exploration skills, their analytical skills, their problem solving skills, their conflict resolution skills, which is necessary for everyday life. What they learn from the age of four to five will be what they need to be functional in the world. Tap your nose if you had fun. Snap your fingers if you had fun. Tap your toes if you had fun with your friends. Now, what are we going to do now?